Disclaimer, do not send hate to anybody I say in this video, or do not send any hate to me. These are all my opinions. There's a problem with Gorilla Tag content creation. Most channels nowadays use audios and put Gorilla Tag and put their Gorilla Tag gameplay over it and make it really hyper edited to appeal to a younger audience while also being really easy to mass produce. One of my examples for this is a creator named Trix. Please do not send hate to him. I'm just using him for this example. And I'll play one of his newer videos up. I get that people need their bag and need to get paid, but I don't think this is a good way for Gorilla's Head content creation to go. Another person who does this, I think, is one of the only people who can actually do it right. And his name is Ani GT. I call, I say Ani GT. Uh, I don't know if that's how you actually pronounce it, but yeah, I actually watch most of his videos, so yeah, and I'm going to play one of his recent videos. The video obviously goes on longer, but I just cut it short because I may get copyrighted for that as well, but you may notice that, like, it's pretty similar to, like, um, the Trix's video. And it's because I think he is also going down the, path, the same path as Trix, which is kind of sad to see. But he still posts pretty, some pretty high quality videos. Especially like his edits. So he he is still a pretty good YouTuber. And I am actually friends with somebody who knows Trix personally. And I I remember how Trix used to actually like post regularly. And whenever he like didn't post cash grabs and stuff. I've lost connection with him, my old friend, uh, because um, my Discord account got uh, deleted and I ne never got back to him, which kind of sucked. A little off topic, but yeah. Uh, another type of content that I don't like is the Tyler VR type of content. Like, more so his old videos. And it. No hate to Tyler VR, by the way, just saying. It's where, like. It's where you, like, um. Don't touch this color and stuff like that. And. I think it's not as bad as the brain rot things that I was talking about earlier. I don't think it's as bad as that, but it's kind of like, it's like really easy to produce and I think less people are doing it now, which I think that's a good thing. And the third type of content that I don't really like are the ones where you have like beach gameplay kind of like commentary like I'm doing right now, but it's like showing some audio from or sound from a channel and uh, puts auto captions above it. And I'll admit I've done this 
uh, like four or five times. And I only do it whenever my channel's views are low. And whenever I need some views, which is understandable. And I can get by somebody doing it for that reason. But some people's entire channels are just those. And the most popular, like, Gorilla Tag video ever has, like, 15 million views. And it was one of those videos. And it got... And the one before it was a video of... It was from Aussie VR, where he did a ghost video. It was fake, but it, it was better than him. I forgot the name of the content creator, but he made the most popular Girl Tag content video from that. That's kind of all I gotta say, and yeah. Please like and subscribe, and if anybody sees this, who posts content like this, just please change.